Hi, today is Sunday, October 6th, and it's um, a couple days after I rang the last game of Bo, which um, was a lovely celebration with the family and, and people, my friends and family cheering me on, uh, wishing me well. It was a great hurdle to jump over. And um, and I started making these videos and I told myself I was gonna be vulnerable because it's really hard to be vulnerable with your feelings because feelings are personal and not everybody really understands them sometimes and some do. Um, I guess today I, I find myself feeling like um, a little lost. God, I'm not sure. I, I am grateful and I'm gonna keep on trucking along in this journey. Uh, I guess I feel like some people think because I rang the chemo bell that it's over. And it's not, it's a hurdle. And uh, I have several more to go. Um, I'll have a break and then I have a month of radiation. So 20 rounds of radiation. Um, and that'll be every day. And I'm, I've heard from several people that compared radiation compared to chemo is a breeze. And that makes me feel better. Uh, I follow some groups, uh, online and, um, the consensus is radiation is not as taxing, uh, as chemo, um, or as difficult, but it has its own challenges that you're going to, I'll have to learn about, you know, like lathering up the skin and getting it ready and protecting it and make sure it stays hydrated and again staying hydrated and what I do read a lot about in these groups about radiation it seems it causes fatigue but I'm used to being fatigued I mean I'm not anything special it's just uh again I've said this in a couple of my other videos that I have ADHD so I have lots of energy so even though I'm fatigued my mind is always going and um, exercise is really good for me. It's a great outlet. So I just do it tired. And uh, I'm not anything, I'm not a superhero. I'm just trying to get through this. Um, but I'm excited to be cheered on and encouraged. So thank you. And um, I don't know if any other cancer survivors can relate to this where I just feel like not so sure. All of this is just challenging um, where you spend a lot of time hibernating because you don't want to get sick and then you've gotten so used to not being around people and protecting your energy because again, as I've mentioned before in another video, uh, when you have a health scare and uh, it just makes everything else seem really small and insignificant because um, the only thing that matters is being here and saving my life and being in good health so I can be with my husband and my family. So, uh, yeah, that's about how I'm feeling today. Um, but I know that feelings will pass and I'll, and I'll, uh, just keep marching on, fight the battle and keep bringing you videos and trying to be vulnerable so that I can help other women and I even get help through them sharing with me. So, all right. Well, I hope everyone has a good start to their week coming up and, uh, and they're enjoying their fall weather. Love you. Bye.